TLC Network here at CES 2025. We're at the VZIX booth here with Adam. Adam, how are you? I'm doing great, how are you? I'm doing fantastic. Yeah. This show is always exhilarating. So, yeah. <laughs> so much tech, so much fun, so little time. Uh, and uh, we're excited to be here at the VZIX booth. Uh, you guys have been uh, in the industry for quite a while, looking with, uh, working on augmented reality and uh, uh, some really nice optics for your glasses, growing and growing, you know, growing that feel of view, growing the experience so that it can be implemented in a much larger atmospheres. So uh, you're coming from a history of mostly enterprise, but now you That's have something correct. new that might be able to break out of that bubble a little bit. Yeah, so uh, the pair of glasses that I'm wearing right now, it's called the Z100. Uh, it's built on our ultralight platform. Um, so this pair of glasses, it's just a smart display uh, that has a Bluetooth connection directly to my phone. And so it's really made for snackable information, right? So you're not gonna watch a movie on it, but you're gonna get your text message if I'm standing here talking to you and I can get a text message and I could be reading it and you wouldn't even know it. Uh, you know, anything that can really send a notification to my lock screen on my phone will just natively start sending information up to the glasses as well. So it's kind of like having a smartwatch, but a lot more co covert. That's really. exactly right. Yep. So what's the field of view like on these new ones? Yeah, so these glasses, they're 30 degree field of view. Okay, yeah. and are you looking down or is it more centered or? Uh, so this pair, I mean, we can position it wherever the user or the, the end customer would like it to be. Uh, this pair of glasses, it is pretty much straight and centered on. Uh, Okay, yeah. fantastic. And 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 how you just worded that uh, takes us to the next section of, right. uh, or the next question is how you're presenting this to the market. You're not necessarily selling these directly. You're actually creating relationships with other companies that want to be able to bring this product into their line with their name on it. That's correct. So where we really shine is in our capabilities of design and manufacturing of the waveguides themselves. Uh, so we have all the IP and all the manufacturing capability in Rochester, New York, uh, to be able to manufacture all all of the waveguides ourselves. So we can work with a customer to design and based on their specs and where they want the display to be and what they want their form factor, their industrial design and their glasses to look like. Uh, and we can customize all of that with them. Now, obviously you don't sell these products yourself to the consumer, but based on you know the, the complexity of the design and everything and how that, you know by the time they get integrated into other companies' products uh, and, and eventually to the end user, how affordable do you think they would be compared to something like a smartwatch? I think eventually you're going to start to see that price continue to come down, especially as volume goes up, uh, right? So like this pair of glasses, you could buy today for four ninety nine. Okay. Uh, right directly from our website. So you uh, do technically this, sell to these, the consumer. We, we yeah. sell them kind of as a developer edition. That makes kind of how okay. we have them tagged, right? But um, if you want a like, developer yeah. edition and call it your own, right? You, you could. could. Anybody yeah. can buy one. Of Absolutely. These. That's right. cool. And and our app, you can get directly on the the App Store uh, for iOS and Android, and it'll directly connect with these. So no dev classes. kits required or anything else. Works right Not, out of the box, just as is. That's correct. If you wanted to basically be able to provide you your text messages, any any sort of notification. It's all there. Uh, we also provide an open SDK right off of the developer section of our website. Anybody who can make an Android app or an iOS app, uh, we've got all the everything you need to be able to make that connection to the glasses. Nice. So it's kind of like Joe broken glasses in a way, where you can expand on it however you wish. You got it. Uh, it sells them even better just in that alone. And uh, what's it like when we look at how long a user would be walking around with these on their face, on their head? Yeah. You know, how long do you think this would take a user in terms of battery life? Like, is it going to get them through a full day yeah. or a couple of days or like half a day? Or sure. No, it's a very valid question. So these. Uh, I probably won't end up charging them until the end of the week. And nice. I'll be showing them off to people all week long at the show, right? So because you're just getting kind of snackable information, you're only turning the display on for short periods of time. And all the processing is happening on your phone instead of on the glasses. So we're able to make them very power efficient uh, and you get multiple days out of the a pair of glasses. That's a pretty good selling point right there. So if you want one of these already, you can get them. They're $500 on the website. They are expandable if you are brave enough to play with the dev kit and come up with your own apps and or if you're actually going to buy these for you know their proper use for your own business for developing your own apps and products they're there and uh, it'll be interesting to see what kind of brands pick these up 
you know, as it gets out there. And uh, if we'll see them with, you know, like Oakley or anything else, you know, as, as they roll out. Uh, but obviously you have a very wide line of products that you've been working on. And uh, so a lot of these are similar. So these are kind of uh, uh, all the same glasses for the most part uh, that we're looking at right here? Yeah, so we call it all our, our ultralight audience, our ultralight platform uh, that we're looking to, to partner and brand with uh, others, right? So we can either completely just white label it or we can work to customize it with a partner. And so it, it kind of moves down the line to additional capabilities. So you've got the basic uh, just display, display that I've got on today. Uh, the next one adds speakers and a microphone and the display. Uh, so we call that the audio, uh, super creative, right? Mm -hmm. And then uh, and the final one is the pro. And so this is the latest one that uh, that we just announced uh, earlier today. Uh, we designed this one in concert with, with Quanta Computer. Uh, and so this one has dual binocular, full color displays. It's got a camera, it's got multiple beamforming microphones, uh, stereo speakers, and then it also runs the Qualcomm uh, and AR1 platform. Uh, so it does Android natively on the glasses. Uh, so you can you can stream. It's got Wi-Fi, um, and you can stream YouTube or whatever you'd like to watch uh, directly in the glasses. Oh wow! Yeah. So you you've got everything covered. That's right. And uh, this is exciting. Of course, you can do regular glass. Can you do prescription strength or anything like that? Yeah. So all of our glasses are prescription ready. Okay. Um, so it's a, a aftermarket snap-in prescription uh, is currently the the approach for the Z100, the ultralight. Um, so you buy the glasses, then you just submit your your prescription, uh, and then a couple weeks later you'll get your prescription. Or you can do sunshades. That's right. Yeah, that's, that's great. Right. So uh, obviously if you wanted to learn more about this, you're going to go to uh, Vizix's website uh, where they have all of these, uh, all, or well, at least you have these available. That's right. Uh, these are just more conceptual, right? Yeah, So, uh, but the devices in the back are more our enterprise level devices that are used for like logistics and picking. Uh, they're used in warehousing. They're used by doctors. They're used... Uh, I can see I'm, I'm getting a real, real real wear and some of these other brands kind of feel when I see sure. this. So. Yeah. Yeah, 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 so it's very similar, like military applications. So those are all also devices we've been selling for years. Um, they, you could buy one if you wanted to. They're a little bit more expensive, and they're really, I'm sure, they're really built towards uh, enterprise users. Does this one have voice control or anything? It does. I kind of figure yeah. some of the other ones did, so I'm like, that's yeah. kind of a given. Yeah, exactly. Uh, and that kind of plays upon the whole hands-free model. So that's right. Uh, so if you want to learn more, like I said, go to V6's website. You can get a developer's edition, a, a dev pair for $500 and work on your own projects. And or if you're just a cool consumer who wants to have something neat on their face and uh, get their text messages in a very sly way where nobody else is seeing your uh, your information, uh, the chance is there for you as well. So Adam, thank you so much. Absolutely. And I can't wait to see these out there in yeah. the market. Absolutely. It was a pleasure. If you want to stay on top of all the latest and greatest and or at least the gadgets we cover, remember to subscribe right here. Subscription button. Click it. You're going to want to. There's lots of videos, interviews, previews, all sorts of stuff. Button. Click it.